Hello viewers and subscribers. Today we will see the use of image tag in HTML. So first you should know what exactly image tag. So image tag is used to add image in web browser. By using image tag you can add any kind of image in web program. So image tag is having three types of attribute first attribute is very important src it represent the location of image file so suppose your location is d drive with even image dot gif gif is the extension of file okay so it means this image must be present in d drive and with even if this image is present then it will be shown it will be appear in web page Second ALT attribute means suppose your net is slow or there is some problem with the image it is not opening then there will be a use of alt attribute then in place of image it will show the text if image not opening third width and height it will simply represent the size of image by using width and height you can set the size of the image so if you didn't understand then at the time of writing code you will understand so let's see the code so here i open the notepad and uh, you are already aware our code will starts with html and then close with html if you don't write also then also your web browser will take automatically then here I am not writing head and title tag. I want to save my time. Here directly I am writing body tag. Body BG color is important attribute. Suppose green color. After that if suppose I want to add text. You can say text color also here. Text color is white. It's better if you set these two attribute bg color is green text color is white simply close body tag that's it after that directly first i am setting one text h1 i want to give heading like image image program closing h1 finish after that you are already aware about h1 tag it set the heading and after that i am using image tag img we had seen attribute src equals to Here you have to specify location. So this file, this is the notepad file. I am going to save in D drive in VD folder. And in this folder I have two images. Means you can select JPG image also, PNG also, GIF also no problem. You can select any one. So suppose I want to show a dot double a dot png image okay and this file and image in same folder so you can directly specify the image like a dot png this is my image file you can specify width and height of image So this is width and height and this is the image file. Now this is our simple coding. I save this. Here you select all file option. I am saving in D drive with the one there my image files are also there. 
so this is image1.html so i just double click and check output so now my web page is loading here you see this is the output this is the output came from h1 tag and this is the output which is came from img tag let's see this is the coding first body tag you are already aware that's why background color is green text color is white h1 image program this is the text and this is a.png this is the image this is width and height so in this way we have written image program now i close this here both the image and program means your source code present in same location so you don't need to specify the path but if you want you can specify like that suppose it is in d drive d colon you can use small letter also no problem vd1 sorry control z this is actually height value here i should write d drive vd1 and a dot double a dot png this is width and this is height okay so in this way you can specify path but if both the image and source code file is present in same path you don't need but if you specify you can specify or if this is present in other drive like e drive or suppose it is present in other folder then you have to specify that folder and drive whatever it is there then i save this minimize again i check output and your output will be same okay so in short if the image and this file is present in same location then in the source code you don't need to specify this you can directly write the image name so it is good if you specify both source code and image in same location okay so now you are already aware about that width and height so in this way you learn how you can open the image or how you can set the image in web browser you can use png jpg not a problem okay so i hope you understood this tutorial and please subscribe my channel thank you